What's up everybody, this is JC from Hobby Monster. How is everybody doing out there? I hope you guys are staying safe and strong throughout this pandemic. Um, today, we're gonna do a quick update of, of where my channel is going and what are the stuff that you guys are going to be watching going forward. And which will be in two different components. One is giveaways and next one is upcoming product breaks. So I, I'm trying to give you a few of you guys more information that what's actually coming up soon from today. So let's get to it. So giveaways, um, there will be a three different components for this, these giveaways I'm planning. Uh, first one is per content giveaways, pretty much similar to what all, many of the YouTubers um, are doing these days, giving away a card or um, extra card lots to to the people who are leaving comments, who are subscribers, and stuff like that. More details to come, so um, please wait for uh, next slide. Uh, next one is monthly giveaways. I want to do something more about theme driven, um, and I'm also really open to your suggestion. Um, this month I chose um, Last Dance, which is basically uh, MJ's last run uh, with the Bulls, and then uh, and this is a documentary that's on ESPN right now and everybody's watching it and especially with no sports around I think this is a really catchy and trending issues that everybody's talking about so I was thinking about what is the best way to like you know kind of get that involved into my channel was I picked a theme of Last Dance MJ cards so more details to come and last portion of it is special giveaways so there will be a hundred sub subscri subscribers giveaways um, uh, there will be announcement as well, but I uh, there will be different milestone 100 subscribers It could be 500 subscribers or a thousand and uh, so on and so forth and every milestone we hit I'm gonna do a something special for the subscribers who've been supporting me and providing me a lot of feedback along the way And lastly is a family and friends giveaways. So we'll get to the details so per content giveaway is pretty similar to what all the YouTubers as stated here. Every content, th there will be a giveaway of a single card or a card lot depending on the poll. Um, I won't be able to give away an uh, entire card lot if I'm opening up seven card uh, box like Contenders Optic Football or uh, any of those first, um, first off the line because they only have five to seven cards. But I can still pick a card to, um, to send it off to people who are commenting on that video. Um, but if I opening up something bigger box like um, you know top series one or two they may have more than 300 cards there then I can probably pick a entire lot uh, to give away or something like that so I'm trying to be creative on that side but it's gonna be again it's gonna be relatively similar to what all the youtubers are doing everyone will have a chance for a week from the creative date of that uh, particular content all you have to do is being a subscriber like the video and leave a positive comment comment including the card you want so um, when where whenever the the video is created it's going to be a week from that video so everybody will have a full week to um, uh, put the comments down and then I'll basically upload the um, the giveaway uh, winner announcement uh, it could be a separate video or it could be part of the uh, new content so uh, I'll do it either way and I'll definitely randomize the uh, comments from that video on the following week and we'll upload the uh, um, yeah there's a there's a little misspelling right there but we'll will be uploaded um, as a part of the giveaway winner announcement next one is a hundred subscriber giveaways I, I first first of all I want to thank you all for uh, who, who, who's been supporting me uh, along the way and who's provided me a lot of good feedbacks to kind of grow my channel and then uh, be able to pick a, a right uh, product for it and just try to make it more um, more uh, more effective channel that everybody will have more fun with it um, without you I could not never grow this far never never get this far because I started this channel without any of my personal friends like literally like none of my friends are into those uh, trading card hobbies or collecting business um, so I really started started uh, from the scratch without any any help around it really the help was provided by those subscribers that I know or I may not know um, and then who are watching my content and providing me the feedback so I really want to thank you for it um, as a hundred subscriber giveaway it's a relatively small one uh, the 2017 rookies and stars blaster box which um, I, I've been using opening this box for the content uh, searching for Mahomes mostly and maybe Chris McCaffrey um, 
but uh, th this thing is valued around, around like $50 on eBay, I think of 40 to $50 right now. Again, it's not like something too crazy, but I want to send, send off something uh, that's meaningful so somebody to open up those fresh lobster bars from 2017 and uh, share the joy with, uh, with whoever the winner is. So what you have to do is leave like and comment and then giveaway video will be uploaded. Um, so when I say giveaway video is um, I'm, I'm gonna upload a uh, video that's gonna be uh, that I want you guys to comment on it um, and the comment will be randomized and picked uh, from that video so that will be uploaded this week so please um, please look for those video to be uploaded uh, either tomorrow or sometime this week um, and then winners will be announced from month from that video so uh, if I upload it today is May 7th um, the winners will be announced in June 7th and I'll ship it out to whoever. All you have to do, leave a like, comment, and then send me an email if you're the winner uh, to hobbymonsterjc at gmail.com. Next giveaway. This is something that I really wanted to do at some point and something I wanted to be relatively unique from uh, other channels, but um, I want to give it, uh, like everyone in this hobby, uh, collecting hobby, sports card collecting hobby, um, it's based off your your um, your old memories. Like you grew up, we all grew up with the uh, watching sports and then collecting cars um, in in any sport that you're into, and that, that's how the hobby business actually been growing. Uh, again, like these days, a lot of investors are actually coming in and try to make um, make more of a financial gains out of it. But uh, uh, people like us, like we have a lot of old memories about uh, you know like watching sports and then actually collecting those type of things and saving um you know use your savings like those are the couple dollar chump change savings into uh, buying those cards so i i, I want to share that uh, joy with you guys so write me a story about uh, love of sports of uh, from your kids or family members uh preferably younger members who are getting into hobby it could be um uh, the beginner in hobbies or it could be uh, somebody who has more expertise but uh, it doesn't matter um, and send me uh, their their favorite team and player and what I'm gonna do is I'm, I'm gonna put together a package to send it out to uh, one selected email uh, which will be introduced in one of my videos so basically I'm gonna pick one email or one story from from one of you guys and then I'll um, I'll upload a video with that the package I put together um, again like this may not be like super crazy value um, but I wanted to do my best. I, I'm, there may be a lot of base cards, but also try to mix it up with uh, lots of inserts, short prints, and even autographs if I, if I have them available. But it's really depending on what I have at the point of time on my hand. So I'm not going to pick a, um, a story um, who's, who's rooting for some uh, Hank Aaron or whatever. I may not have ha that many of a Hank Aaron cards. I may have some uh, short prints from like Top Series 1, uh, 2020, but may not have that many, then I may not be able to, I may have to delay that uh, until I get more cards for Hank Aaron and stuff like that. Or I may purchase some from eBay just to kind of make these packages. But again, the whole intention is try to make uh, those younger folks involved. They don't have to watch my channel, but then actually um, give them a little bit more joy uh, to those younger folks who are into sports and then uh, sports cards uh, hobby. So. Um, yeah, please, uh, starting today, please send an email to hobbymonsterjc at gmail.com and, uh, and, and I'll, I'm gonna, I'll be really appreciated if you guys share those, um, um, the, the small stories and then um, I'll, I'll be able to um, share that joy with, uh, with your folks. So that's, uh, that's a family and friends giveaway. Uh, last one is monthly giveaway. So I'm open to any suggestion. Um, I'm actually trying to do a uh, not just a per content giveaway, but I want to do something more of a monthly and I want to pick a theme um, that's more of a trending issues or burning issues that's happening in this uh, car business or car uh, hobby business or even the sports world. Um, this month I picked a uh, last dance, which is Michael Jordan's last run with the Bulls. Uh, which is currently being aired in uh, ESPN and I think it's a really uh, fun documentary especially when there is no uh, sports, real life sports around um, everybody's watching it, everybody's talking about it and MJ is by far the, one, of the, uh, one of the greatest NBA players um, so I kind of went through some of the older cards I collected and I picked these five Michael Jordan cards from early 90s mostly in the 90 through 92 I think and I picked five Michael Jordan cards. So these are the cards that you're looking at. I basically took a picture of them. So the condition is as is. They're pretty good condition. There's no uh, like uh, 
there's no dinged corner there may be some whiteness on the side but that's pretty much about it so these five cards i'm going to send it out to one winner so again the announce this is a monthly so we're going to announce the winner in the first week of june for this last dance giveaway so please feel free to um uh, comment on this video so monthly giveaways i'm gonna uh do do the comments on this video and i'm gonna randomize the winner uh in a month from now all right uh enough of the uh, giveaways i'm I, if there will be a uh, different ideas that i can do for the better giveaways then i'm gonna do my best but for now um, we're gonna move on to the upcoming product break uh, obviously, I collect three sports, baseball, basketball, and football, and from many different brands. I do Topps, Leaf, Panini, Upper Deck, uh, NBA Hoops, and then Bowman, but also MJ Holdings. So uh, actually, there's a m majority of the product I got that's made, uh, that's packaged by MJ Holdings were pretty uh, waste of money, but there's a one content I'm, I'm trying to do uh, that I'm actually really excited to. So uh, you'll see that in uh, weeks to come, but um, um, I'll, I'll, I will occasionally buy those MJ Holdings product and see what I can get out of. So upcoming product, data release calendar from the website that I, I saw from, I think it's a from Still City, which is pretty consistent with the blowout card and stuff like that. But given that manu manufacturing having an issue with the COVID impact, there may be some delay. And I know a uh, certain product has already been delayed, but uh, this is uh, more up-to-date information I have at the moment and if there will be update I'll let you guys know but the again the dates are based on those calendars so first product is a Panini Prism Baseball next product is a Panini Diamond Kings Baseball which is on May 15th and 2020 Bowman Baseball is May 29th I know first edition uh, thing came out I did not um, I, I, I did not know it was actually released until people are start opening it and now the price is kind of ridiculous to get those first edition so I'm not gonna buy those but this is a one hobby box I actually pre-ordered it uh, which is now rescheduled to be released on May 29th and next item is 2020 tops pro debut baseball I don't think I pre-ordered it just yet but I really wanted to open up those minor league players so I'm probably gonna buy one of those hobby box and open it with you guys uh, next one is 2020 Topps Tier 1 Baseball, which is uh, expected on May 29th. And Topps Finest Baseball is on June 3rd. And last one, uh, no, uh, next to not last one is a Top Series 2 on June 10th. And lastly, on 2020 Topps Stadium Club. Um, I may pick up uh, certain retailer boxes, Mega Box or Blaster Box, time to time. But these are the hobby boxes I already um, put up pre ordered. And next one is a uh, uh, coming product break for basketball. Um, there are only four um, four boxes that are currently coming out, except for the National Treasures, which is National Treasures and Panini Noir, which is like over thousand dollar price range. So I'm not getting those. But these are the four major ones that uh, a lot of you guys can probably buy as a retail version, or maybe hobby box if you're willing to invest in a little more. Uh, but these are the four boxes I pre-ordered it. Uh, one is a Panini Court Kings Basketball on May 15th. I'm expecting a, a pack war with a JP break. There are more details to come later on later. Um, but that's one of the boxes I bought. And next one is a Panini Mosaic, uh, Mosaic Basketball. I know retail version has been released and a lot of people haven't been opening it uh, already. But the, the reason I'm living in, um, they don't have those. We don't, so I didn't get my hands on. Uh, when the Optic uh, retail version came out, I actually ordered it on eBay. Uh, pretty much doubled, uh, I paid, a, paid a price, which is doubling the uh, retail price or even uh, triple the retail price. But I really wanted to open those Optics. But Mosaic, I'm just gonna, since I pre-ordered my hobby boxes, I'm just gonna wait for my hobby box to arrive. Hopefully it's gonna be May 15. I don't know what the, uh, the up-to-date information, but that's the, that's the date I got from the calendar. Uh, third one is Panini Spectra Basketball, which is also May 15th. And the last one is Panini Obsidian Basketball, which is May 20th. So I'm expecting a uh, four products in uh, within, a, within a week. I don't think that's gonna happen, but uh, if I do, then we'll have a lot more product, basketball product to open up. So hopefully Zion and Ja and my PC, Kobe White, maybe uh, it's been a while since I opened up any of those 2019-20 basketball products. So it'd be, it'd be fun to open those one up. And lastly, upcoming product break for football. 
is 2019 Panini Chronicles football is coming out in May 15. Again, the Panini manufacturing uh, situation, this may get delayed as well. And 2020 Panini Contenders draft pick is May 15th. Uh, 2020 score, uh, Panini score is May 15th, and then Legacy Football is May 20th. So those are the four uh, football products that I ordered it. And so those are the upcoming product break that I'm planning on, and I already placed a pre-order for. But on top of it, I am I am scheduling some of the Giannis. Uh, for the basketball perspective, I'm gonna do Giannis Hunt. Uh, so I ordered a couple of the 2013 um, basketball product to look for Giannis. I didn't get a prism um, because those boxes are like thousands of dollars um, for one retail box or one hobby box and stuff like that. But I ordered like alternative um, items to find for a uh, uh, search for Giannis. But I also have a 20, uh, 2012 version, uh, 20, uh, 2012 hobby boxes coming in for Kawhi and Anthony Davis and Damian Lillard uh, rookie search on those cards as well. On top of it, for football, like we do DeAndre Hopkins search that's coming up soon. So I have a couple of 2013 boxes, which is relatively affordable these days. And then certain like 18 and 17 boxes as well. So it's not just about the upcoming product, but it's also for the uh, you know, going back, turn back clock type of uh, items that I'm gonna open up more going forward. And that's also, um, on top of uh, all the subscription boxes I, I do on a monthly basis. Um, so one, it's a, a boom box and uh, the brothers in card, I do all three sports on a monthly basis and uh, mostly on the platinum level. And then uh, occasionally I do all about the hobby and some other eBay purchase as well. So those are the stuff that I'm gonna open up uh, as well as this upcoming product and then older product that, I'm, that, I'm, that I bought and now I'm gonna buy. So. Uh, that's it for today. I, I know it's, I thought it's gonna be a shorter video, but now it's all almost at the 18 minute mark. So um, I'm again. I, I want this channel to grow with you guys. I, I want to give give back a lot uh, to you guys with some of the cards that I don't want and some of the cards that you guys may like. And uh, I want to share some fun with you guys and keep growing my channel to um, you know to my next milestone. So uh, this is the plan that I put together. Uh, please feel free to uh, um, you know, leave a comment and give me some feedback on it. Like what what um, what do you uh, what do you want to get out of from this, uh, this this channel? Like I'm trying to I'm trying to make this quality more better quality content going forward. There will be more. Um, I'm getting better at it too, um, but I still have a lot to go, uh, a lot more to improve on this channel personally. So uh, feel free to um, you know leave any comments and then. Um, yeah, let's get uh, let's get this thing work out, and then I I want your engagement. Like I want to hear back from you guys, and then uh, share some fun stuff, and then uh, give me a constructive feedback. I uh, love to hear hear that as well. All right, so that's it for today. Um, for tomorrow, I'm gonna come back with the uh, more product break, and then uh, there will be a monthly giveaway. Um, no, hundred subscriber giveaway uh, video will be uploaded real soon. So please look for that. All right, till then, you guys please stay safe and I'll see you guys later. Peace.